Okay, well, I'm absolutely not sure what that was about, but the glasses definitely don't do that. So if you want to find out what the glasses actually do, continue watching this video, because I'm here to tell you just that. That is the most cheesy introduction that I've ever done in my entire life. I can smell the toe cheese from here, and I'm disappointed, but I digress. The glasses. Okay, so here we have the Enreal glasses. I'm not quite sure if I am saying the name right, but here they are. The Nureals, the Nureals, Nureals. Here is the box. As you can see, the design is cute and simple, like me. <laughs> I don't say so myself. Now, as you can see, the glasses are really sleek design and they're very, very lightweight. I believe they're 75 grams. Um, so they're pretty lightweight and very, very sturdy. As to be expected with these AI glasses. As you can see, inside the lens are tiny OLED screens and they are 1080p. So when you look into them, everything looks pretty crispy. Pretty magical. I actually think it works by the lens reflecting onto your eye and then you're able to see everything in front of you through the glasses, but I am no tech queen, so don't quote me on that, but I believe that is how they work. And the other amazing thing is when you put them on, you can see all the holograms from every single different angle. You can see it from there, you can see it from there, left, right, to the side. It's pretty, it's pretty impressive. I didn't actually expect them to be this um, good and also as well as seeing things you can hear everything with these little speakers behind your ears and they are decent crispy quality as well as I was saying it does have the two open ear speakers on the back bass boost virtual rendering echo cancellation noise cancellation of course speech enhancement and of course the dual microphone array basically these tiny little speakers on these glasses pack a good punch but they won't destroy your ears. So it's, you know, best of both worlds. Great headphones, no ear damage. Oh, 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 and another thing, it's also got the three DOF head tracking and the head tracking is incredible. So if you want the three DOF or the two DOF, you can actually click this on and off, which is also great. Um, but the head tracking in general is, oh, Chef's kiss, baby. With the glasses, you also get prescription lenses. So if your eyes are awful like mine, I'm a minus 4.75. I'm that bad, I can't see anything. Um, you can take these in and obviously get your prescription put into these glasses so you can use them without your glasses. Um, or if you wear contacts with like me, just wear your contacts really. Of course, it comes with a lens cleaner, a detachable cable, a case, a cleaning cloth, and also nose pads. Because with glasses, as you can see, they've got the little nose pads thing. Maybe you've got like a wider nose or a more narrow nose or just in terms of comfort, you want to change your nose pads. I think that's really good that they've actually included those. Um, so they sit perfectly on your nose. I didn't need to change mine. Mine were good for my nose, I guess. My nose was the nose for the original glasses. Is that a flex? Don't ask me why I'm trying to flex that. Anyway, as you can see, I'm trying the glasses on. How do I look? Do they suit me? Do they look cool? I think they look pretty cool. They haven't made them to a lot of brands. They make these types of things, right? And they make them look really not cool and not fashionable. It's no secret that I like fashion. I like to, you know, take care of myself. I like to make things go with my outfit. And for me, sorry to be shallow about it, but these glasses actually look cool, like they look nice and I think they would suit everybody. So if you do want to look cool, these are, these are very cool. Maybe they're not because I'm not that cool, but anyway, I digress. Okay, so let's see how they work. They also, EE kindly sent me the 5 Oppo Find X5, it's right there, so look at it. <laughs> um, because this, the glasses only work with Android, so you will need an Android um, phone and it will have to be compatible. There'll be a link below and you can see what phones are compatible so you don't buy these glasses without being able to actually use them. So um, the first thing you need to do is connect your glasses 
to your phone. Just plug it in, both ends, and Bob's your uncle. The app will pop up and you'll be able to use your glasses. Sorry, my DMs are pretty disgusting right now, so you might hear them go off in the background. So yeah, you open the app and as you can see, we are in the MR space. You can or you can click the casting option and cast your phone, which we will do later. Let's head into the MR app. Now, there is a quite a few games that you can download, which will go with the app. Unfortunately, um, the app didn't come preloaded with games, but you can go into the app store and pick games that are suitable for the glasses. So I'm not quite sure what you can see yet because I'm editing this after I'm filming this, but um, there is so many things that you can do. You can, can it's like having a whole desktop in your eyes. Um, as you can see, you can have so many different, um, so many different screens open. You can watch YouTube, you can browse the web and it's all in front of you. And it's really, really, um, <sighs> would I say spacious? So it all looks perfect. It's all in front of you and it's not stressful. You can have five tabs open, you can move them about, you can zoom in, you can zoom out, you can flick them to the back, you can adjust them. And it's all really, really smooth. All you have to do is you just point your phone and use your phone as a control to guide you around all the different apps. It's really, really good. When you click onto YouTube, I've got a bit of Taylor Swift on at some point, I think. Big reputation, big reputation. Oh, um, we have big Oh, with doff mode. Um, and the music's played in your ears. It's such an immersive experience. You can just sit and it's in front of you. And you, it, it, the glasses aren't heavy on your head. It's just there. I'm using YouTube, but I'm not on my phone. I'm just enjoying, I'm stuck in. And I think this is really good to actually get stuck into one thing because when we're watching things normally, we're watching and texting, we're watching and talking. And I kind of miss being pulled into something. And I really think that these glasses do just that. They really suck you in. You are in the metaverse. The other thing that I'm really impressed by is everything is very, very sharp. Everything. Um, as I said, the resolution is 1080p and it, it's just incredible. Everything is crisp, everything is vibrant. It's very good quality. And I, I was, I'm always gonna be honest, I didn't expect the quality to be as good as it was. So I was very happy, impressed, love it. But another thing that you can do is you can lean your head from any direction and it follows you. So if you're fed up of sitting and you wanna just literally like lean back and watch like this, watch your film or just do whatever you're doing, you can do that with ease and everything is looks great. <laughs> <laughs> now, one thing that um, I tried to do was play some games on camera. Now, I was able to connect my Xbox to my phone and play some games. However, when you're screen recording, it doesn't let you screen record that. But I do want you to know that it does work really well. And having glasses and your game just like that is incredible. There's also a little um, blackout thing that comes with the glasses that you put over the glasses. So it's like you're having this amazing VR experience because obviously you can't see anything that's around you. You can just see what's in your eyes at the time. So when you've got a game on, it's just the game and it's <gasps> super comfy. You haven't got this like big thing around your head. It's just the glasses and it works really, really well. I'm pretty sad that the phone wouldn't allow me to capture that. But I'm gonna I will try and include some clips that show game. you what it's like. But yeah, it's pretty incredible God. being able to connect your control or play on your phone and having the game right in your face. The big thing, the big but for me was, will this work outside? So I took it outside and this is what happened. Let's go and have a look if it works outside, but I don't think it will. Let's go. So, it works, it works. It fully works outside. It's bright, it works so well. I, I can't believe that I'm seeing this fully outside. That's actually shocking. I don't know if you can hear me, but incredible. It flipping worked, it flipping worked. I wasn't expecting it to work like that, but I could see everything crisp, beautiful i i did not expect it to work because the one the other one before i don't think it worked as well outside but this you can you can wear it outside no issue in the bright you can't even play on your games outside like it's crazy I, 
honestly, I'm very impressed. But overall, what do I think? Now, I think it's so amazing to be able to play games and be immersed into, I guess, social media and technology um, with this perspective, having it actually in your eyes. That, now, the only downside so far is that I can't screen record for longer than like 30 seconds to show you what's going on, to share everything with my followers and to record gameplay. And obviously another downside is that it only works with Android, which obviously I have an Android now, so you might have to get a second device to actually use it. So basically it's a really interesting piece of technology and I've never used something like this with such high quality. So I don't actually have a lot of bad words to say about it. Everything ran smoothly, there was no cutouts. Sometimes you'd have to, I guess, make sure your wire is in properly or it would cut out. But uh, apart from that, everything worked perfect, perfectly well. So I think from a tech standpoint, I would definitely pick up this gadget. Is it a necessity for life? No, completely not. Like this is, you know, this is a privileged tech piece of technology to have. But are we gonna start using them in our normal lives? Probably, it's so comfortable. I, I can just work like this, head straight, good posture, and everything works perfectly well. I can play games in bed, great posture, sat there enjoying myself, just playing the game, and being so sucked in that nothing else around me matters. I think it's incredible. And yeah, if you wanna pick one up, links in the bio. Uh, I hope you enjoyed my little tech review. I'm not the best at tech reviews, but I'm trying. And I'm gonna go now. I'm gonna go, but we can't leave it out the cyber hugs. Mmm, a lovely.